Hi guys, so today I want to share another story with you. Today I want to talk about 90 Day Fiance, Annie Gets More bad news about Robert. So if you watch my channel, you know by now that this channel is a teaching tool for all scammers, gold diggers, and losers. I mean, that's all I report about. You know, I don't report about anything good. If you've got a good marriage, who gives a damn? This is a teaching channel for gold diggers, scammers, and losers, okay? Because we can't have people messing up the gold digging profession like Annie has done. She has really messed it up. She is a shitty gold digger. Okay, so let's get into the details. So we all remember last episode when Annie came to the harsh conclusion that she really picked a bad guy to gold dig because he was broke. Remember he took her to the Goodwill to go clothes shopping. She thought she was going to get Versace and Chanel and ended up at the Goodwill or Salvation Army, a place like that, and she thought that was bad news. Okay. Her luck is going to get even worse, people. Okay, so we all know that Robert has a cute little boy, a son named Bryson. Turns out he has five children, a total of five children and four different baby mamas, okay? I mean, this is Annie's fault. Now, you mean to tell me that this article that I'm going to read from Starcasm can find out that Robert has Five children, but Annie couldn't do any research to find out what was going on before she gave her clothes away and came over here to the U.S. I mean, the least she could have did was go on his Instagram account and realize that she didn't see any Versace or Chanel on there. I mean, what a disgrace to the gold digging race. Now, according to the Starcasm art article, they have literally tracked down three of his children. One is little Bryson, then he has an older brother and older sister. The two oldest ones, they haven't tracked down yet. And, that's, they're, and they're thinking that's because Robert's 41 and these two older children must be adults. 41. Don't forget, he's 41, she's 30. But it gets worse than that, people. How can it get worse? It gets worse. Okay, so now, according to the Starcasm article... It's the type of baby mama that Bryson's mother is, okay? This is a headache and a disaster waiting to happen. So we all know that Bryson's grandmother is a stripper, and his mother, her name is Susan, is an alleged nut job, people. Okay, so and especially court, according to this um, this domestic violence with child case filed back on her on June 6, 2016. Okay, so... They have a domestic charge case against him where Robert is the victim, okay? This woman is violent. This is bad news for Annie. Okay, so according to the police officer, he was called to their apartment on November 20th, 2016. He says when he got there, he met with Robert, who stated the following information. He says that his girlfriend, whose alleged name is Susan, got into a, him and Susan got into an argument because she, he wouldn't let Susan into her bedroom. At this point, Susan got upset, barged into the room, and started pushing him. I mean, she's violent, people. I mean, if she does this to Robert, who knows what she's going to do to Annie? He goes on, he says, Robert stated he then tried to restrain Susan, but she continued to try and push him. Susan then began grabbing random items throughout the house and throwing it at him, making a huge mess. Now, this next part is extremely alarming, okay? So, this is the officer talking. He said, I asked Susan to stop. She refused. At this point, I was standing in the middle of a living room when she deliberately charged into me. She charged into the police officer people. Like, okay, if you want to beat up on Robert, that's one thing. But now you're taking down cops? Oh, Annie, you really outdid yourself this time. Who wants to deal with a baby mama nut job like that? I mean, just that situation alone is a bad situation. But not to mention that Robert has a rap sheet. Okay, he got sued for child support. He got arrested twice for driving with a suspended license. I mean, he also got evicted. Okay, people? Now, Annie... Now, correct me if I'm wrong, gold digging, the art of gold digging is about the come up, not about the come down. Like, who wants to get evicted every two years? He's broke. He's got baby mamas all over the place. Listen, this is a huge disappointment to the gold digging community. Now, listen, but I don't want this to discourage any other future gold diggers. No, just learn from Annie's mistake. I mean, if you're going to be a gold digger, please do a background check. I mean, please, it's the least you can do, and you would save yourself a lot of time. 
Now, I have a feeling this isn't going to be the last story I'm going to do on Robert and Annie. Because like I said, I only report on losers. And it seems like they both have the qualifications to be on my channel probably for the rest of the season. So that's all of the 90 Day Fiance news I have for you today. What I want to know in my comment section is, do you think having five children and four different baby mamas is a deal breaker for Annie. Also, if you like this video, please don't forget to hit that like button. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and do that. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.